Manitoba settled three class action lawsuits this week worth $530 million. They have agreed to repay upwards of 30,000 people who were in the child welfare system their children's special allowances. The federal money was clawed back by the province over a 14-year period to the tune of about $300 million. The CSAs are meant to help kids in care get the same level as support as other children receiving family allowance benefits. At any given time in Manitoba, there are roughly 10,000 children in care. 80 to 90 percent are Indigenous. To be eligible, you must have been a provincially funded child in care between 2005 and 2019. The settlement goes for approval by the courts on June 14th, followed by a 30-day 30 30-day 30 appeal process. Uh, uh, Flett, one of the uh, plaintiffs, is hopeful a distribution plan is in place by September. She says kids who are currently in care and eligible could see funds deposited in their accounts as early as this fall. She also says legal costs will come out of interest gained on the money. You know, it's a significant amount of money, right? Like it's over half a billion dollars. So when the money comes in in, in July, I guess it would be when the appeal period is over. Um, just investing that, I mean, we've had the calculations done at a conservative GIC interest rate. Um, you know, it would generate around nine hundred thousand dollars a month in interest. So it will it will add to the fund. And that income will pay any legal costs as well as the cost of administration. And anything that is left in the fund when all that is done, um, that is going to be a second round of distribution. So that is also going to go to the kids.